Morris Shea, a leading deep foundation contractor, completed installation of DeWall screw piles at a vacant Renton, Washington Sam's Club that is being repurposed as a Home Depot. New foundation piles were required to support higher floor loads, resulting from Home Depot's heavy inventory materials and forklift equipment. Dewall screw piles were recommended by Morris Shea as a value-engineered alternate to the base bid micropiles. Dewall screw piles were able to accommodate the project's interior height restrictions. Pile load testing was performed in two locations to assure the VE concept achieved project specifications. A sacrificial bit was attached to the bottom of the Dewall SP tool. Sectional casings with special quick disconnect couplings were added during drilling to achieve the required depth. The special DeWall screw pile tooling forms a 14-inch diameter pile shaft with a concrete screw blade that projects out to 20 inches in diameter. Two remote control Fundex CD20 drill rigs with 20 ton meters of torque and 15 tons of crowd force were used to install the DeWall screw piles. The rigs have sectional leaders, which can be adjusted from 13 to 60 feet in length to accommodate various height restrictions. For this project, the CD20s were equipped with 18-foot tall leaders, which operated nicely in the 20-foot restriction from the roof trusses to the floor slab. Due to the 20-foot height restriction and pile lengths up to 55 feet, Sections of temporary casings with quick disconnect couplers were added during drilling to achieve required depth. Excavators with special tong attachments lifted and maneuvered the sectional casings. Prefabricated welded steel cages were manufactured at Morris Shea's Angleton, Texas rebar fabrication shop and shipped to the site in 10-foot sections. Once the Dewall SP tooling was drilled to the required depth, cages were lowered into the temporary casings and spliced together to create full-length reinforcement that satisfied the seismic design requirements. Morse Shea manufactured high-strength sand cement grout on site with a volumetric mixer to ensure that grout was always fresh and piles were poured without delays. The volumetric mixer batched the grout onto a conveyor belt, which transported the grout to a ready-mix truck for final mixing and storage. Grout was transported to the pile locations using telescopic loaders, equipped with custom-built three-quarter cubic yard buckets. The buckets contained hydraulically controlled gates, Grout was discharged from the buckets directly into the casings as they were extracted by the CD20 drill rigs. The grout level inside the temporary casings was maintained above the working grade during tooling extraction to ensure positive head pressure within the casing. Pile lengths varied from 30 to 55 feet and were terminated on rock for a portion of the building and at a dense sand layer for the remainder. A few select piles were excavated down several feet and were shown to be well formed with consistent pile body diameters and concrete flight diameters and pitch. Morris Shea installed a total of 225 DeWall screw piles with each rig producing three to six piles per day. Morris Shea offers a wide range of foundation systems that can build design efficiencies and construction savings into your next project. Contact us today about deep foundation installation throughout North America and beyond.